2020 marked the 35th anniversary of Back to the Future, my favorite movie of all time. Now, weird as it may seem, the movie never got proper action figures. Not in 1985, not in 1955, and not in 2015. Um, there were some crappy, very, very crappy reaction figures. There were some sucky Funko Pops. Um, of course, we had the excellent Playmobil sets, but never. And there were the very, very expensive um, Hot Toys, uh, very excellent likeness, but very expensive, high-end adult market. But never, let's say, Star Wars, He-Man, G.I. Joe-esque or type action figures, which is weird because the movie was and is a genuine phenomenon. No idea why no toy maker ever took the plunge. Were the rights too expensive? No idea. So, lo and behold, in 2020, we finally got the proper Back to the Future NECA action figures, and the first one in the series arrived today. The ultimate Doug Brown. Let's take a look. 35th anniversary, lovely packaging. As you can see, this is sort of Doug Brown's workstation. Um, Flux capacitor, sketch, uh, watch, glasses, wrench. Um, back of the box, uh, ultimate Doug Brown. Includes do not open envelope, flux capacitor drawing, wrench, goggles, blueprint, and interchangeable head and hands. And collect them all, more figures in the series. I've pre-ordered them, but they have not yet arrived. Let's see. Yeah, and as you can see, this is one gorgeous likeness. This is a major thumbs up for NECA. So, the blueprints. The flux capacitor drawing. And <laughs> the do not open until 1985 letter. Amazing likeness. This is Christopher Lloyd as if he just stepped into your living room. Great stuff. And some accessories like extra hands, goggles and the wrench. We'll see what NECA does with the franchise or with the license, but um, this is a very good start. Great stuff, lads. Great stuff. 